lightweight scrap. So two years, the gap in age, some differences in height and reach as well. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buff. You ready to fight? Ready. Well, here we are inside the famed O2 Arena in London, England. Good to have you with us as we get underway. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. That strike will count. Gagnon gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Oh, nice punch there by LaPreeze. Getting the hands going here early. Just missed with a huge kick. Switching stances here. Oh, effective strike there by Gagnon. Well, he continues to find his timing here. Series of strikes there. Oh, man. He is hurt. Oh, look at this. Who saw that coming? Side control. those hands up, Joe. Oh, hammer fist here by Mitch Gagnon. And back to the mount. Ninety seconds now to go in round one. Trying to set up an arm bar here. He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. Turns the hips. He's going to sit back. Throw the leg over the face. Break the grip. He's got it! Round's about to end. Sunk in that submission and got the victory. Right, I mean, how do you not admire the focus of this young fighter? You could tell he was looking for that submission much earlier in the round, but he didn't want to rush it. He stayed patient, let the setup do its thing, and ultimately the submission materializes organically late in the round. High-level stuff out of that young fighter here tonight. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at four minutes, 50 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, Mitch Dunham is five years the elder. The rest of the numbers are effectively identical. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buff. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go. Jab to the head by Evan Dunham. One-two punch by Burns. Dunham gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. Huge block there. Good punch. Nice defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. Dunham gets hit with a kick. Ooh. 
jab. That one hurt. from this position. Under three minutes to go in round one. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. He establishes back control. He's got the back looking for the rear naked choke. Trying to get that arm under the chin. And now he's got that arm under the chin. From there, he wants to grab a hold of his bicep, and he wants to put his other hand behind his opponent's head for maximum leverage. That's it. And there it is. He got the choke for the tap. So yeah, it came down to tap out or go to sleep, and his opponent chose the former. The choke was clearly sunk in deep, perfect technique, and ultimately that is one of the bigger wins of his career. He gets it done by submission here tonight. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 56 seconds of the very first round. You're going the winner by tap out, Evan Donna! For this lightweight scrap, more than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and reach. You ready to fight? Ready. Dateline, London, England, good to have you with us as always as we get underway with live action from the O2 Arena. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Max Blessed Holloway. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Block that strike, now counters with a leg kick. Well done there by Alcantara. Tagged him. Holloway shot is blocked. body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. He's gonna have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Hollow. Lands a jab, and both guys really thrown with authority. Oh. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He is rocked right here, he's trying to stay up. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He locks up a triangle. He's got the leg over the shoulder. Now, he's gonna pull down on his shin. He's got the knee over the ankle, pins down, push the arm across the face, pull down on the head. And that will do it! Use Excellent technique in getting that choke for the victory. Well, you can tell he has been working hard on his submission. Can we go back inside the octagon for the official decision. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at two minutes, 18 seconds of the very first round. We're playing the winner by tap out into a triangle choke. Yuri Marajuana! for this lightweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, and they both possess. You ready to fight? Ready. Well, good to have you with us, and right on time, I might add, as we get underway here at the O2 Arena in London. Nice. Kick lands for him there. Misses a huge hook to the head. Slips the punch. 
excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Well, he gets cracked to the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You gotta get that head off the center line. Trujillo's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Double leg here. Nice punch there by Trujillo. Huge punches landed by both men. He clipped him with that one. Slips the punch nicely there. Oh! And he connects with the punch. And the kick lands. Oh, doing a damn good job with those leg kicks, Joe. And now you'll start to see his opponent slow down. Absolutely. Amir Khani going for the takedown here, but he misses. Oh! Abel's in big trouble here. He's in real big trouble. Oh! Huge shot there, Lance Flush. Oh, very nice. Amir Khani gets caught with that punch. Using his jab effectively here, Joe. Oh, nice strike landed there by Trujillo. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. Amir Khani gets the single leg kick. Neither guy doing much at this point. jab once again. Oh, he snaps off the jab yet again. Beautiful use of the jab, really. Start to finish tonight. Did it in the previous round and picking up right where he left off here. Good defense there. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward. Oh, oh. this could be it right here. So he's gone to the well 
called for the takedown several times here tonight, and perhaps another takedown attempt is imminent. Oh! Well, he just... Oh! oh! And just oh, like that, the fight is over! Beautiful shot to end the fight here. Outstanding knockout. Yeah, Joe, I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of... Here's Bruce Buffer. He has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 3 minutes, 33 seconds of round number 2. He's playing the winner by... Knockout! one, Mr. Finland! For this lightweight scrap, three years apart, with the same height and some. You ready to fight? Ready. We are underway. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Elkins gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Excellent movement here on the ground. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Oh, that hammer fist attempt defended well. It's blocked. Full guard now. himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Elbow strike there by Elkins. We cross the midpoint in round one. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. And he's going to try to take the back. Transitions to full guard. Postures up here and now going to the body with that big strike. Nicely done by Elkins. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Elkins gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Darren Elkins. Oh, and he lands another takedown there. He's already landed several in the fight and really doing a great job with these takedowns, not telegraphing his shot. Back to the canvas now here. Yep. Postures up and delivers a massive ground and pound punch to the head. Oh, man, I love it. Now he moves to full guard. 45 seconds remain in the round. And he gets the hooks. Nicely done. Oh, he got cracked. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. 20 seconds left. He lands with the left. Big body punch. Horn sounds for the end of round one. And here, incredible highlight. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two is underway. Oh! Tags him. Maybe a cut to the left of the nose. <laughs> These guys are just standing in front of each other and throwing bombs. Oh, hammer fist here by Elko. Moved into half guard. He, he landed a left hand there. Nice sweep. We show you the total strikes. 
So the takedowns have come in bunches here tonight. Look for him to try to set up yet another one here. He'll find that window, barge right through the legs, and get his opponent to the canvas. That's a good strike there by Medeiros. Body kick now by Elkins. You gotta be careful when you throw the same technique yeah, over and over and over again. Wow. He's in big, big, big trouble. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Back to over under control. Oh, now the hook in the clinch by Darren Elkins. Elkins has got the double under hooks here on the clinch now, Joe. Let's see what he can do with it. So we have crossed the midpoint in this one. Oh, and he connects there. Yeah, and here he goes again. Continuing to pile up these takedowns at will throughout this round. Throws the left hand. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Trying to spin to the back. Now he's in full guard. Ninety seconds now in round two. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now he's going to find himself in the pocket. One minute. He's going to try to take the back, I think. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. 20 seconds to go. All right, hammer fist here by Elkins. Wow! My right, round three coming up next. Oh, saved by the bell. The round is over. He got stuck. Third round underway. Starting off the... Whoa! Big shot! He's got him right here. Oh, he might be out. Huge kick oh. misses. Wow! He's out! Oh, he's out. He's out. Excellent timing here. Big left hand for the victory. Yeah, Joe, beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So we send it inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop for this contest at 20 seconds of the third round. Playing the winner by knockout, Darren Dan. Our main event of the evening. Moraga is 12 years his senior. North cut. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go. UFC lightweight title on the line. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Sage North cut. Blocking all the shots coming towards his head. He's doing a great job blocking these shots. Pretty good straight punch there by Super Sage Northcutt. Looking to avoid that left hand. Oh, oh he's got the huge oh. right hand! He's in a lot of trouble. The champ is in deep danger here. He's really hurt, and he is gonna lose his title if he can't recover. Body kick, look at that. Oh. Try to establish that jab. Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed. Oh! He's in trouble. He's in trouble. Boom! Shin to the dome. Oh! Good defense to block the strike coming back. Nice head kick. Well, he's got a strong jab. Miss with it there, though, Joe. He's teeing off. 
Nice defense there. Huge block. Oh! He hurt He's got him hurt here. He's in big, big trouble. Oh, he missed that kick. Hard hook. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. Man, these guys are throwing back and forth. Whoa, head kick. Oh, big left hook there. Excellent defense here. Really good job blocking all those shots coming at his head. How about that shin? Kick to the body by Super Sage Northcutt. Oh! He got tagged. He got tagged. He's hurt. Can he hang on? The left hook hits home. Big shots! Nice leg kick. Big straight punch. What a wild exchange! That shot blocked by Morag. That's again the experience. Northcutt gets hammered by that solid uppercut. That one got his attention. Jab. Keeps going back to that jab. Keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Caught that one. Oh, beautiful uh, strike there as he lands up top, and he does so right after catching the leg. So maybe. Ready fight. Ready. Second round underway. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Another nice leg kick there by Sage Northcutt. Effective punch there by Morag. I mean, the hand speed, just absurd. Oh, vicious body shot. You can tell that shot hurt him bad in the body. Oh, worked in the inside of that leg. Leg kick checked effectively there by Morag. Straight punch gets through. Hand speed, man. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Exactly. And a good counter left. Moraga gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Whenever you see a fighter's legs stiffen up like that, that's not a good sign. Oh, solid jab. They continue to exchange. Swing and a miss by Northcutt. Moraga gets in the clinch yet again. And they disengage from the clinch. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Two minutes to go in round two. Oh, blocks that kick to the bottom. Nicely done. Another shot lands upstairs. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Sage Northcutt. Nice punch by Morag. Oh! Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. He lands an excellent combination. Oh! Dropping down, looking for a single. Perfect execution as he gets the single leg takedown. Excellent sweep. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Vicious combination of total oh, That's going to do it. <laughs> Sage Northcutt does it again. Ground and pound knockout. Well, that's the way they used to ground and pound fighters back in the day, literally trying to pound your opponent's head through the canvas. Elbow. We get the official decision from Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 21 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still. Just a quick moment.
moment, cause I see that you are in me.